right, welcome back everyone. We are proud to bring you more oil and gas news that is happening around our community. And I'm so honored to have John Kelsick. He is actually the chairman and founder of Element Fuels. And you have something incredible that's going on right now. So tell us more about that. Sure, well thank you for having me on, Sharon. Appreciate it. Uh, yeah, we have permitted the first new build large scale refining asset uh, on the Gulf Coast since the 1970s. It's a refinery that's designed to process U.S. shale crude specifically. Uh, and we will also have to build along with that a combined cycle power plant to help fulfill the power needs of South Texas and the Brownsville area. And this is basically homegrown. This is our own backyard that is doing this. Why is that not only important, but what is it going to mean to this community? That's a great point. It's, it's what makes us unique, honestly. Uh, our refinery is designed to process shale and shale products. So one of the things we noticed 10 years ago when we started this entire adventure was that the U.S. had a great refining sector here in Houston especially, uh, and, but it was designed to process heavier crudes. The shales in West Texas and the Eagleford are very light. So our refinery is designed to process American shale crude. Mm -hmm. And the video you're watching is actually file footage. It's not their refinery, but it's file footage that we were showing you of one refinery. So, okay, meaning that you're doing this, this is a game changer in the industry. Tell us more about that. A absolutely. So one, not only do we process the, the lighter crude, yes. but because no one has built a refinery from scratch in the U.S. in 50 years, yes. we can do it in a better way. Right. This is a great bridge to take fossil fuel and the energy transition together. So for example, when we process a component of, of oil called naphtha, mm -hmm. we're able to harvest hydrogen. Yes. And then we can use that hydrogen to basically power and heat the refinery. And when you burn hydrogen, you generate no CO2. Exactly, I was thinking the same thing. So I mean, not only are you burning this hydrogen, but you're also helping the environment. So it's a it's a win-win situation for so many people. And it could, it's like I said, a game changer is gonna open up more jobs and more opportunities for the future here in the Lone Star State and beyond. A absolutely. So today we export 4 million barrels of Texas crude. Yes. This lets us use some of that here at home. Mm -hmm. It also generates jobs here in Houston, which is where our technical headquarters are located at, and inside Brownsville in the South Texas area will generate hundreds of long-term permanent jobs and thousands of indirect construction and other jobs. What does it mean to you being that you're at the forefront of doing something that is just changing so many lives and could in the future for decades to come? Well, when, when you put it like that, I just start off with a little idea some guys and I had together because we saw a problem and wanted to fix it. Mm -hmm. And it for us, we look at it as an opportunity to participate in the energy industry, which we love, in a way that we think is great for the planet. And again, we all love the environment, and there's a way for fossil fuel and clean fuel to coexist. And so for us, we're very humbled that we can be a part of that process. So how can people find out more information about this process, about Element Fuels, and so much more? Well, thank you. So we have a website, elementfuels.com, uh, and we have LinkedIn and other tab candidly i think my kids need to help me with the technical side of things <laughs> but our website's probably the best way to do it and the, the port of brownsville has some information they've been terrific well thank you so much for being with us we're gonna have a lot more on our website cw39.com this is the forefront everyone this is what oil and gas is doing and you're taking it to the next level thank you so much for spending some time with us thank you really for having me on it, sir appreciate thank it. you so much all right and we've got a lot more coming up in just a moment but first Let's take a live look outside, everyone. It's the Strand Cam, and it is Galveston, courtesy of Galveston.com. We're CW39 Houston, no wait weather and traffic.